Okay, we're here at the Ocean Explorer and we're watching our decapod steam shovel. A female lobster uh, molted last week. We had to move her into the scallop tank. And uh, right now you get to watch uh, her redecorate the tank. Um, this is how they dig out burrows. Um, they dig out the sand and they push it along like a steam shovel. Or uh, actually more like a bulldozer, really. And um, let's see if she'll do it again. Sometimes they use their claws. She's missing one of her claws. It popped off when, she, uh, when we pulled her out. Another touch tank which was molting. Right now she's doing some weird stuff with her feet. It's almost like trying to scratch an itch. Take the sand out of her eyes. Yeah. Here she so let's goes. see if she does it again. Yep, here she goes. Very Grab strong. the sand. We need like one of those backup beeper sounds, you know. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> and so as you look around the tank, um, there are rocks over here on this side of the tank and piles of sand that used to be, all this stuff used to be over here. And, uh, and hermit crabs, she picks them up and the shells, um, she moves them around. And it's amazing how strong they are. It's a nice little close up. Lobsters are also known to be uh, cannibals. They'll eat, they love to eat other lobsters. In fact, when they're larvae, uh, lobsters have multiple stages, larval stages. And uh, the way they eat is they're kept up in the plankton. And whatever they bump into, they grab it and eat it. And so this presents one of the challenges of culturing lobsters because they're being suspended in a culture tank and if they bump into each other, they eat each other. The challenge is balancing out, putting enough food in uh, with overfeeding so as to minimize uh, cannibalism. And as we go through the different molts, um, they grow and uh, the last molt stage is called the Superman stage where they fly with their hands over their head just like Superman the two little claws out in front of them, and uh, they swim through the tank that way. Hence the name, the Superman stage. Stay tuned for more lobster uh, tidbits. And uh, oh wait, Lindsay, Lindsay is gonna feed the lobster Why on not? film. Go for it, Lindsay. All right, we, what do you got there? Uh, I have a small piece of smelt. All right, speak up so, loud so everybody can hear. Well, it's a, a small piece of silver side. I usually give her smelt. All right, smelt. can we get a close up of that little? Oh yeah. All right, so we got silver side or smelt. She's very aggressive when I think. Sometimes she grabs the tongs. Yeah. Here she comes. Bang. You don't want to mess with her. And when she's hungry, sometimes she just chops them in half when she grabs them. Um, and uh, if she's hungry, she'll devour that fish in uh, a couple minutes. And sometimes, there she goes, she's eating it. Yeah, she'll go through that thing pretty quickly. So if you are interested in uh, staying updated, um, and you're a volunteer or staff member here at the Ocean Explorium, um, make sure you click on the subscribe button uh, so you can subscribe to this YouTube page. That way you'll get an email reminder every time a new uh, video is uploaded and you'll constantly be learning new things about the animals and the tanks and the exhibits. And if you have a question or a comment right below this video, uh, there's an area where you can post a comment or a question, and we'll answer your question for you. Thanks for, uh, thanks for watching, and stay tuned for more. The hermit crab's trying to come in. Here, we're going to do the hermit crab. More to come. Make sure you subscribe to the YouTube page. Bye for now.